An absolutely crazy story breaking just this morning, guys. That being a French streamer, a very large French CSGO streamer known as KRL, apparently being sued for defamatory language and maybe other things for $250,000 plus dollars for speaking poorly of a gaming or esports school known as EGS. A very crazy story. I'm currently speaking to someone closer to the situation. I will keep you all posted on this, but wanted to get the initial video out there because it's an utterly crazy situation. Last time we talked about a Twitch lawsuit, it was on. Um, it was pretty gross if you guys remember that it was um, I'll say this a very sexually charged story that did fall through this lawsuit though putting someone like KRL under tremendous stress and anxiety put yourself in his shoes for a second from what I know about this situation it was actually him supposedly talking to or reading a message about a student from this gaming school known as EGS that message seemingly was portraying the school in a not so bright light I do believe different wording was actually used KRL actually reading that message and responding to that message on stream and ever since then is now being sued by that same gaming school again once I get better details I will keep you all informed but the amount breaking a quarter million dollars for being sued for it's it's an utterly crazy situation. Also, if you guys are CSGO fans, you know Hoongoon Gagni. I've always, I never know how to pronounce his name. I just call him Hoon. He's actually given further details as well on the situation. Dating KRL, a French CS streamer is getting sued in France for over 200,000 euros. He's getting sued by a gaming school he previously worked at for two months and afterwards talked about his experience on stream, mostly saying it was bad, I assume. Now the school is suing him for more than 200,000. They are directly blaming KRL for for the failure of their CSGO section, this is the stupidest thing I've read online and I used to follow Trump. And the school themselves has now responded, guys, but they've also now privated their Twitter. So I can only tell you so much. The most accurate translation we have found so far in their post and response says, Hello, everyone. It is with reluctance that EGS has chosen to initiate legal action against a streamer named KRL. Following his repeated actions during the last few months, we cannot tolerate or endorse anymore. Today, we would rather let the tribunal defend our intentions as well as approve that our judgment is well-founded. This process is the only valid one in France to protect one's Self. We leave it to the justice system to appease the situation and decide its outcome. A procedure being in progress, we won't communicate any additional information about the situation. We thank you for understanding. So now you understand just how crazy this is. Outside looking in, knowing no further details because they will not be shared from either side. I can tell you guys KRL is probably done speaking on this situation because of the legal circumstances. And the same goes for EGS, who has now privated their social media. It's, it's an insanely shocking situation. You would maybe think this will not go anywhere for simply someone having an opinion about a school that they also worked for for a short period of time and maybe speaking poorly of it. It's crazy that school has now fired back. That esports and gaming school is now suing for over 212,000 euros. It's, it's shocking. I will keep you all posted with future updates on this. And I can't imagine being in KRL's shoes. I, I'm sure he guys, I, I'm sure he would appreciate your support in this situation. It's, it's madness. Today's been crazy. Hope you guys all enjoyed though, all right? You know what to do. Take a sip for me. I'll see you back here next time. Take care.